sitting out by the old fire bowl. Yep, Friday night fire bowl, and we are going to have a sing-along tonight. Yes, yeah. with one of our favorite songs. What's that? It's a song. It's it's, it's called Insat. Insat. E N S A A T, which means. Nashville. No, East Nashville. A song about a train. About That's a train. Right. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Which I might say, East Nashville is something that Don introduced me to. When we first started dating, I learned to love this phrase that he had, and he would say often, I want to show you something. And we would be driving down the road, and he would say, oh, I want to show you something. And we would diverge off. And he would always show me something I had never discovered before. And that's how East Nashville was. We were going somewhere, and he said, I want to show you something. And he took me to East Nashville, and I just fell in love with just the funkiness of it. I mean, it's like this funky hip. Funky down. <laughs> yeah, with all these brightly painted, artsy bungalows and hipsters. And you've got, you know, these hipsters with these suspenders and capri pants on one side and homeless people and gangsters on the other. I mean, it's such a diverse area. And I mean, it, it, it has really become just one of the jewels of Nashville. I, 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 I'll, I'll live on the west side. Thank you. <laughs> Well, I'll live on the west side, but I'll go eat dinner and on the east side at Three Crows. <laughs> okay, so what kind of... We've got a weird wine where we've got... We've had this for a few years. Mm -hmm. Yes, and we have. It's a triumvirate of wines, but mm -hmm. we chose one of them tonight because yes. we're running low. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's... These, wines, uh, these are rock and roll wines. Uh, yes, they are put out by a company called uh, Wines That Rock Vineyards. And I bought these for Dawn several years ago, and there's one that's from the police. And the rock group, the police. The rock group, the police. Uh, which celebrates uh, synchronicity. That's right. Uh, we also have the Rolling Stones and the Grateful well, Dead. Dead. And I'm really, I was really skeptical, and now that I've tasted it, the the, the police wine, it, it it does taste like licking a urinal <laughs> at precinct 12. Well, I think we chose the one, the police, since we're singing about East Nashville. You know, as the famous, the Na Nashvilleans will recognize the famous T-shirts that say. Mm. <laughs> I'm oh from, God! I'm from East Nashville. Where's my bike? <laughs> Where, where's my lawnmower? <laughs> where's my lawnmower? Yep. So, <laughs> anyway, well, shall we begin? Yeah. We're, oh yeah. We're, again, we're gonna sing a song, a sing along. Mm-hmm. With an artist that we first heard. At, yeah, we we discovered it inside a cave. Yes. And, and we the, loved it. We did absolutely. We didn't go to hear him. I don't know who we went to go hear that night, but he was like a side act, and we just fell in love with him. Yeah. Aaron Lee Tajgen, and we heard him at Bluegrass Underground. So here is our sing-along to a song. Where's the stick of justice? <laughs> I don't know. Here it is. <laughs> it's Aaron Lee Tajgen, moved to East Nashville and write a song about a train. That's not the name of it. Well. Move to East Nashville. Well, but that's what he says. All right. Okay. On. Okay. And we're going to sing along. Can you hear it? Is that as big as it is? Yeah. Well, the kids in this town, they don't have a clue. They're as white as the collar that they painted blue. Get it together or pack it in. Obviously, we're not 
professional singers. <laughs> no. From a clothing pin. <laughs> Playing my guitar. It only rains. We went out to East Nashville and write a song about a train. From, from a place, place so dark, dark. you have to burn the whole thing to just see, see a spark. spark. Oh man, that's deep, man. <laughs> Why he died so young? So fast. <laughs> Provide a link for the real video. <laughs> what was that? Hey, move out to East Nashville and write a song about a train. Well, we got booze and pills for pain. Booze and pills for pain. That's not all they've got in East Nashville. <laughs> no. Here in a minute. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. They got a good restaurant, son. Well, you can't turn away from your own two feet. Give away what's, what's not yours, yours to keep. I cry to you and I feel wrong. I need you like a teenager needs a song. That's a great line. Well, the money is gone, but, but the, the attitude's stuck. Uh, the attitude stuck. Mm -hmm. Cuts are all about trucks. Oh, that's a shot against, that's a bow, bow across the Cumberland River. That's it, right, the music ride. Right. It's almost as bad as what they call it punk rock. Some singers think the sweetest words profane. Move out to a Nashville and write a song about a train. We got America caught up in and crack cocaine. <laughs> Move out to a Nashville and write a song about a train. Mm. Sing it, Aaron. I think you guys gonna say sing it, Tony. Yeah. Da 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 da. The Don and Kenda show. Well, we'll put a link to that video because that is a great song about a little gem of a neighborhood in Nashville and about the current state of the music industry in Nashville as well. Yeah, so. I, I mean, you you, know, you remember uh, T Tupac and, and Biggie Smalls and the yes. murder and the, and the whole East-West yes. uh, rap thing? Well, they kind of got the same thing going on with East Nashville, West Nashville. It's been going on a long time. There just haven't been any murders. That we're, we know of. Well, we're civilized around here. Fireworks! Almost. Yeah. <laughs> We're almost civilized. That's right, right we are. Uh, Drinking our police wine. <laughs> oh, God. Precinct 12 <laughs> urinals. <laughs> but check it out. Aaron Lee Tashton, A Song About a Train. It's awesome. Wow.